this is a jig that I 3D printed to copy my car key. On one side you see an upside down drill bit uh, following the grooves of the old key. Uh, and on the other side you see an end mill uh, that's going to cut the new key. Uh, they're both 1.5 millimeters in diameter. Um, and uh, let's go see if this works. I'm gonna lower this bit down. I'm just gonna lock the little spindle, unscrew the collar, and the end mill drops in place. Tighten it back up, and I need my wrench. And I gotta plug it in and turn it on. I need your protection. Let's have a look so far. Not bad. Not bad. I'm gonna try to clean up that center portion. Another look, pretty good. Looks a little rough, but I think it's pretty good. All right, gotta, it's half done. Gotta flip this key around. What the hell? Clean up, clean up. All 
right, so that's going in. And as long as it bottoms out in there, it should be good. And here are the keys. Where's a good reflection where you can see? Pretty good. All right, here is the key assembled. This is the one that I just cut. And let's test it out. It's a good sign. All right, very nice. Perfect. Let's try the other way, make sure it's all good. Yep. Nice and smooth. Perfect, that's awesome. Okay, just one more little piece of information. Uh, this is a key fob from Amazon and you can replace the key with one that you've cut um, and it'll fit in the ignition and it'll turn and unlock the steering wheel but it won't actually start the car. Um, I still happen to have the old key that I'm replacing because this got run over so that's why I'm doing this whole process. And what you need to bring over from the old body into the new body is not only the circuit board, obviously, with that the battery fits into, that's obvious, but inside here, that little compartment, there's a little, there's a tiny chip. And that chip mates up with a security feature inside my Hyundai um, or in your car. Uh, and that allows the whatever fob you have to actually start the car. So that's what you need to do as well. Uh, so if your car's not starting, that's why.